Should be a little bit better. Sorry about that. I forgot to turn off my secondary uh, camera. Um, so hopefully that should be a little better. Anyway, make sure you get your orders in like right now, stat this week, code emergency, super duper hot and heavy, like right now, or you're not going to get it on time. Okay. So this is my fair warning to each and every one of you. I ship things because I have a small business of my own that I, of course, did not put in my show. <laughs> I just thought about it just now. I totally should have put it in. Anyway, um, so I ship things every single holiday season, and it's like it takes a couple extra days anyway because everybody is sending shit. And now with COVID and everybody shipping everything anyway and doing all of their shopping for, for toilet paper and everything now, it's like you've got to give yourself time. Anyway, enough enough with the lecture. First things first, the first two products on today's show have to do with security and locking up your stuff and making sure it is safe. Um, the first slide on your screen is a, is a grip lock. Now what this does is this locks your grip and either your brake, if you put it on the right hand side or your, um, standard mount and your clutch, if you put it on the left hand side. So this way, this locks up your bike. If you put it on the brake hand side, obviously your front brake is going to be engaged. and You can't push that bike anymore. This is just a really, really clever, clever little gadget. It's got great visibility because it's up on the handlebar. It's nice and red, red for danger red for warning a lot of the stuff they have to do with safety with locking up motorcycles i mean let's you know just to keep it real with you a lot of this stuff has to do with visibility you know make your bike less of an easy target less desirable by putting things that either are locks or that look like locks onto your bike and it makes it a much less tasty thing for thieves to come and steal so anyway that's the first on your screen is bigpanther.com um, i think that is just a really neat product and their other product that i wanted to talk to you about and they're showing it on a helmet but here's, here's what I did several years ago. I was traveling overseas. And I mean, I travel all the time anyway, but I, I travel with bike and kind of, kind of decent amount. And I go to rallies and I go to races and events. And man, does it suck to lug jacket and your helmet and your backpack and your stuff like around an event. It's summertime. It's hot out. You got all this stuff. You're carrying all this stuff like that sucks. So I thought to myself, you know, self, how am I going to get around this, but still have my stuff be secure? You know, I'm not accusing anybody of being theft, thieves or whatever, but it happens. And you know, I don't want my jacket to get stolen. So I bought, I did my own DIY version of this, which is I purchased. And I mean, you can buy this at Home Depot. I was lazy and just found it on Amazon. I know, shame on me, but a six foot aircraft cable that was coated and that already had the ends fair rolled onto it, secured onto it. So it had two, two loop ends and then six feet in the middle. And what I would do is run that through the sleeve of my jacket and put my helmet with the, with it open, you know, through the chin bar and lock all that stuff to my motorcycle. I'd run it through either my forks or uh, my frame or whatever I needed to do. That's how I locked all of my gear to my bike because that way it was safe I could just leave it there. I didn't have to carry it everywhere. Now that was the super DIY version of that. And I think that that cable was, I don't know, probably like 15 bucks or something. And then I already happened to have a padlock at home. So that's how I did it. But this is a really nice, tidy way of doing this from that big panther.com. Um, this is their version of it. And it's got, as you can see, it's got a little carabiner and that has a lock and that's a coded lock. So that's got a numerical lock on it. And then it's, it's coiled, but it stretches out to six feet. So it's the exact same idea, but they've already done all the work for you and it's cute and it's tidy. And here's the other thing is those coiled locks. They look like a security mechanism, like they look like an alarm. And so in my mind, if I purchased this, I would use it for my helmet and my jacket, but I would also use it if I didn't have a helmet jacket that I need to lock to the bike. I honestly would just wrap this around the front or rear wheel and then tuck that carabiner in someplace so you can't see it. You can't see how it's not really like a like a electronic lock because that looks like an electronic alarm is what that looks like to me. So that's what I would do with that if I purchased this. I thought it was really neat. It's tidy. It's already done and made for you. The DIY version, version of course, I just explained to you. But that's the folks at BigPantha.com. My next little bit of, of what Santa should be bringing each and every one of you is for my buddies at UnionGarageNYC.com. These are my friends at Union Garage. They have the most beautiful, beautiful, beautiful curated list of, of goods for motorcyclists out of really probably any company that I know of here in the U.S. They have, their stuff is just 
spectacular. It's beautiful. It's the top of the line. It is all just very luxury, very, very thought out, beautiful, beautiful stuff. I can't say beautiful enough because their stuff is just absolutely the creme de la creme. And this is their beautiful, they designed in-house tool roll. This tool roll rolls all the way up. Obviously, it's a tool roll. And it's kind of, I love this also because it is absolutely based on the BMW vintage motorcycle tool roll that is just fun and easy and has everything in it. You can literally fix almost your entire motorcycle with the vintage BMW tool roll. So they wanted to go ahead and do an updated version of that. It does come with the tools included. Again, this beautiful tool roll is for my friends at Union Garage NYC. They are running a sale right now over at their website. I just clicked over. They're beautiful jackets. They've got stuff from Barber and Bell Staff, their own in-house uh, Robinson jacket. They've got just all sorts of beautiful stuff and they are running a sale right now. So go click over and go check them out. They also carry some of my most favorite motorcycle gloves. And these are just, again, one of my most favorite things. This is not your Oprah favorite things list. This is your Jackie Van Ham favorite things list. These are Lee Parks, American made, American designed gloves. These are deer skin. These are buttery, buttery, buttery soft and beautiful. They have an inside stitch, which is what they're showing on the screen right now, but they also do an outside stitch set of gloves. Now I have really chubby fingers, they're incredibly small though. So I wear extra small gloves, like literally kid size gloves, but I have such chubby fingers that if I get gloves that small, they don't fit in the fingers. So the outside stitch saves you that little like millimeter or two millimeters of the seams being inside and pops them outside. And it is brilliant, brilliant designing. I absolutely love them. They're some of the only gloves that fit me right out of the gate. Anyway, these gloves are from Lee Parks. They are pricey, um, but they are beautiful. They are worth it. They are soft. They are delicious. They have they don't have any armor or anything in them, just to keep it real with you. But for very, very comfortable, lightweight, beautiful gloves, these are my absolute favorite. I have a set in this um, natural color, and then I have a set in black. I, that's how much I love them. They're just wonderful. Anyway, those are over at UnionGarageNYC.com. Another thing that I love, and this is another really neat American-made product, is Godspeed Company. And if that looks familiar to you, that's because that is a t-shirt, or not t-shirt, that is a long sleeve shirt with reinforced elbow, button down, and, and a little bit of a button pocket made out of shop rag material. How cool is that, right? I think this is so clever and so smart. I've never seen another version of this. I think it is just super kick-ass. Again, this is entirely made in the United States. It is gonna be a little bit more expensive. Stuff here made in this country does cost a little bit more. It just is what it is. Um, so I'm just gonna give you that heads up. But that being said, this is beautiful. This is a this is an heirloom piece. This is gorgeous. I've seen this on he the gentleman that runs this company is named Chris. We're friends in real life. He went and had um, God Stitch Company chain stitched on the back, so you can put patches on this. You can stitch on this. This is just a beautiful kick-ass killer shirt. Um, it's not not like armored or anything like that. It just is a really beautiful, clever gift. I think it's just very, very cool. He also offers these in black. It's just a really, really great, neat thing. And again, that is godspeedco.com, this beautiful shop rag shirt that he makes. Uh, go check them out. So this is for any of the ladies that are watching the show, or if you've got a lady that you're shopping for, this is a buddy of mine, Jennifer up in Chicago, her awesome company called Wind and Throttle. This is a curated women's centric motorcycle website. So this is going to be women's apparel, women's gear is going on over there. So if you're shopping, make sure you go click over and go check out. She's got tons of rad stuff, but I wanted to show you this jacket in particular, because look at that beautiful classic vintage leather motorcycle style. It's absolutely stunning, but updated and with a couple of key functions and features to it that I think just make this over the top. You know, it looks very vintage. It looks very classic. You're like, lady, I've seen this jacket for the past 60 years. They're every motorcycle shop you can't swing a dead cat without hitting one. I know, I hear you, because it's a classic design. It's classic style, but 
It's got really neat things. Like you can see on the back, it has some back either action panels or vents on the back. It does have a little bit of stretch, like action panels at the elbows. It has adjustability at the waist. It has an elongated rear waist. That way when you're riding and bent over, it doesn't ride up and show that crack between your jeans and your jacket. It solves all of those problems. It's absolutely beautiful. It's a kick-ass company. I absolutely love her to pieces. This is from windandthrottle.com. Another red company, um, a girlfriend of mine, Jenna, out on the West Coast, StellarMotoBrand.com. I have been on the hunt, and maybe you have too, for several years now of like, I want safety, but I and I want function, but I don't want to look like a dork, and I need it to be comfortable because I sweat like a hog. I'm one of those always, always hot people. I'm always hot. I'm always sweaty, wearing really heavy, appropriate gear through summer riding season is a real bummer, but wearing a jean jacket is kind of a no-no because it's really lightweight. Well, she has solved all of the problems, my friends, because she makes a full line of kick-ass denim that is woven through with a little bit of a super fabric woven into the denim which increases its abrasion resistance. I know that was really geeky. But anyway, here's what you need to know, is it has the abrasion resistance similar to leather. Like it is absolutely super, super tough. It has this really, really great woven through fabric. It also has armor and armor pockets within every single piece of the riding gear that she sells. And on the page right now, she also sells men's gear. This is not just for ladies. That being said, she has a full line of kick-ass women's gear, but she makes men's stuff too. So I know this show is mostly a lot of dudes, so I wanted to go ahead and include some dude stuff, including this kick-ass. I know you're like, why are you showing me a jean jacket? That's because that is a motorcycle safe plus plus armored jean jacket. How rad is that? And it looks like a totally normal functioning jean jacket. It comes in three different colorways, black, like a neat kind of I don't even know what that kind of rinse look is, but like a rinse look and then like a lighter denim color. Um, and then it is also available, that jean jacket is also available in women's cut as well. Congratulations, Stellar, Stellar Moto Brand. Thank you so much. She offers that in a woman's cut as well. So this beautiful gear is available from Stellar Moto Brand. Dot com. Again, it comes in several different colorways, and she carries and makes and designed herself my most favorite pair of women's motorcycle riding jeans ever known to man. I own a ton of different sets of these because everyone's always on the hunt for the perfect riding jean, at least every woman I know is. <laughs> so I have gone to the trouble and I have, I have hunted down and I've looked for the perfect riding jean and this is it, dude. This jean it's black, it's uh, fitted, it's got some stretch, it's got that super fabric woven through it, it's got pockets for armor, um, it has a lace-up gusseted waistband, so if I'm like, you know, having a lot of snacks on the road, I can loosen it a little bit, <laughs> or if I'm, you know, walking a lot and traveling and seeing stuff and I drop a couple pounds, I can tight, cinch it down a little bit. So these are super forgiving, she carries them in all sizes, this is another huge problem with women's, women's motorcycle riding gear, is that they build for like, very very slim you know typical model sizes but that's not that's that's not what's going on out here like we we, <laughs> we eat we, you know we don't miss meals out here so anyway i love that she is a very very inclusive company she carries a very full range of sizes. Uh, these fit me perfect. I love them to death. She's just amazing and I love her. So I wanted to go ahead and feature a couple of her kick-ass pieces of motorcycle riding denim and that is stellarmotobrand.com. So next on my list, another buddy of mine at Viamechanica.com. Via Mechanica is a custom seat builder based out of Brooklyn, based out of New York City. Um, she does all sorts of rad stuff, so go click over to her website. But here's what I wanted to talk to you about today is maybe you have somebody in your life who is looking to build or have built a custom seat, but they don't know what they want. They don't know what they're looking for. Well, here's the perfect opportunity to reach out to her. Her name is Karina Matlow. She is is a friend of the Chopper Town family out here, um, reach out and, and offer like to put a down payment on something or offer to buy a gift card for that significant other in your life. Because then the rad thing is over phone, over text, over email, whatever's easiest for you. 
you and Karina get to talk and decide like what's what's your perfect custom seat what does it look like what does it feel like is it is it narrow is it wide is it cushy is it is it soft is it is it more rid, rigid for touring is it what color is it what kind of fabric is it like the sky is the limit and she'll build you your perfect dream seat whether it's for bikes whether she also does some cars and truck stuff um, she does it all and she does it beautifully this is top of the line this is premium product and she makes your motorcycle custom bike dreams come true. So if it were up to me and I had somebody in my life who was looking for a perfect seat but didn't want to buy something off of off the, off the shelf, they wanted something a little bit more custom, something a little bit more specific, a more specific color, a more specific pattern, diamonds, ribs, double stitched ribs, whatever, welts, you name it, she's got you covered. So I would reach out to her and I would say, "Look, I want to give this as a gift. He doesn't know what he wants, but here's, you know, a couple hundred bucks as a down payment. Can you send me a gift card?" I'm sure she would love to work with you on that and make that awesome kick-ass totally custom motorcycle gift come true. So again, this is my buddy Karina, friends of the Chopper Town family out here at viamechanica.com. Again, she also does cool um, truck seats. She's worked with car people. She makes, um, she's done saddle bags. I mean, she does, she's capable of doing anything, man. She's, she's just, she's a wizard. So just reach out and talk to her about making your custom motorcycle dreams come true this year. Now, this is not a, a tiny little independently owned business, but this is a rad company. I absolutely love their products. These are made in the U.S. Uh, it's RamMount.com. I know you've probably heard of this, but maybe some of you have not. I cannot tell you enough how much I love my Ram Mounts. They're all interchangeable. They hold every damn gadget you can imagine. They have something for it. Uh, they just do everything. They do it well. This X-Mount, I with the little with the little U-clamp, uh, I have one of these in my luggage at all times. I'm not even joking because sometimes I'll be traveling, whether it's for work or whatever, somebody will want to loan me a bike. I'll be in a new city. Um, I might be working with a bike company and they've got a loaner bike for me, but it's a new city, a new place. And wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. I could put the U-mount on and the X-grip. And now I have my phone in front of me. I can do my GPS to my headset, which is a Cardo headset currently, by the way, um, to my headset. Now I know where I'm going. I'm not lost. It's easy. It's no must. It's no fuss. This thing is super lightweight, easy to pack. Just always have it in your gear. This is just a great, cool, handy thing. You can mount these on scooters. You can mount these on bicycles. You can mount these on ATV, UTVs. Anything with a handlebar, these can mount on, and they have several different versions also. So it can go, you know, suction cup to your car glass. I mean, whatever. I'm not even joking. They make mounts for every damn thing you can imagine. <laughs> so I think these are neat and super handy. And I also am a little bit blind as a bat, which maybe some of you are too. So I love having these with a the little bit taller arm. So it's not blocking like my line of vision as I'm riding, but I'm not like looking down at it. I'm like looking more like this at it. So just something to consider, something to think about. I love these guys. Rammount.com. Uh, another friend of the Chopper Town family out here and friends of mine. I have not one. I've got have not one. I've got two, I've got like two at least two. Nope. Three. Is that one? No. I have three Biltwell helmets on my shelf right now that you can see. And there's a fourth one up top. So clearly I'm friends with the Biltwell family. They're just a rad crew of dudes from Southern California. They make kick-ass stuff. They're super fun. They're super chill. They love having fun adventures. They go do wacky, crazy stuff. They travel all over the country up to Alaska. And they, they just do, do tons of kick-ass stuff. Um, they just started carrying and making and designing luggage. And so while they're known for their helmets, I wanted to give a little bit of love to some of their luggage because they have super rad pieces that are either meant to go on a sissy bar or a backpack that can be mounted to a sissy bar. They've got little handlebar bags. They've got little fork bags. They've got little, I mean, they've got like everything you can imagine, but this bad dog really speaks to me because it's, it, look how, look at how massive, look at how many pockets, look at how flexible this thing is. But that being said, you know, it's not too huge to carry around as a backpack. You can ride in it. You can get off the bike with it. You can also, of course, strap it to your bike, which is rad. All of those different straps and interchangeable little nooks and crannies make it super duper flexible to how you mount it to your bike, how you mount it to yourself, how you mount your, your camping roll to it or your sleeping roll or your weatherproof gear or I mean, whatever you want to 
tie to this thing. Like it is totally happy and down to go on that adventure with you. I think that this is just a really kick-ass bag. I thought it was really, really neat. So I just wanted to show it to you guys. Um, I didn't grab the slide, but when you open this up, the interior of their bag and this bag, this bag in particular, but I believe all of their bags is high visibility orange. So if you have ever opened up a great big huge travel bag and a black abyss and was like, damn, how am I going to find that thing all the way in the bottom? Uh, they thought that one all the way through. It made the inside of this high visibility orange so you can more easily find your stuff in the bottom of this bag. So bravo to some kick-ass design from the folks at BuiltWellInc.com. I love this bag. I think it's super dope. Go check it out as well as all of their kick-ass helmets and all the red stuff going on over at BuiltWellInc.com. Dot com. My last but certainly not least gift for you today, this is for the person who has everything. This is for my friends that work out in their garages or in their wood shops or in their wood sheds or anybody out there that's my DIY homies who is fabricating and making a bunch of stuff. If you make stuff, you also make a mess. Let's, let's, let's keep it real here. If you are making, you are making a mess. I am a little bit on the retentive side, I think is a nice way to put that. So I was just, I've been pleased pleased as punch about this tool. And this is the Vroom Retract Vac. I love this thing. I jokingly say it totally sucks and it's supposed to, but I mean that. It is just... It is just a total game changer. I love keeping my shop nice and tidy. To me, it is very stressful to walk into a messy, dirty environment, whether it's my home or my garage. I just, I like things to be very organized, very visible, very clean and, and like red. Like I want to walk into my shop and immediately be able to like jump in and go to work, not stop and like clean and find things. And anyway, that's just who I am. Maybe you have that particular uh, retentive person in your life as well. So the Vroom Retract Vac, uh, these folks sent this to me last year. I absolutely love it to pieces. If you watch the show, though, you know that I unfortunately had to relocate out of my big, beautiful, gorgeous warehouse space. So as much as that was a bummer, no tears were shed over this Vroom Retract Vac because it comes all the way. It goes up. It goes up. It comes all the way down into pieces and you can take it with you. And that is exactly what I did. It went up, it went down, it's come to me to my next shop. So this is what it looks like installed in a more traditional type garage. As you can see over on the left-hand side, that is the base unit. That is where the engine and the suck happens. This is plugged into just a standard, regular old household outlet. Nothing fancy, no wiring, no weird stuff. And then it has a PVC pipe that runs up and over and down, and then it goes down to the hose. You pull that guy out and it has a flexible hose on the inside that is 30 or 40 feet long. So you pull it all the way from that point, 30 or 40 feet out. So now it can go clean out your cars, it can clean your shop, it can clean your wood, sh wood shavings, it can clean the floor, it can clean the cobwebs. It does everything and it comes up and it comes down. It is super easy to install. It took me like, I mean, less, I can't even say an afternoon because it only took a couple hours. Um, that's how I had it installed at my old shop, rest in peace. Um, as you can see, again, the suction unit is to the right-hand side of my uh, beautiful snap-on toolbox. And then it goes up and over and down. And then you can see the suction unit. I'd pull that guy out. I could clean up all of my metal shavings, all of my wood shavings off of my bench. Um, I used the soft bristle brush to dust off my motorcycles because that warehouse was pretty dusty. Uh, I just used it for everything and I absolutely loved it. And you better believe I took it down and took it with me and I'm going to reinstall it right here at the shop that I'm building here at my house. So uh, I could not, could not do today's show without mentioning my partners at Vroom Retract Vac, VroomYourRoom.com. They've been a kick-ass partner for this past year, but I genuinely genuinely just love their product and it is such it's such a it's a it's a game changer but it's also the most unexpectedly cool gift and unexpectedly cool tool that I think I think anybody would be really really pumped to have especially if, if you've got some DIY folks in your life um but all that being said it can also just use it just to clean out your cars if you if you've just got messy cars or you're a dirt biker um we do dirt bikes a lot so they make a hell of a mess all over the vans so we use those to vacuum up the vans anyway just a little, a little something, something to think about for today's show. What did you guys think about that? All sorts of rad gifts on today's show, right? Like a little bit of everything from luggage to vacuums to mounts to, to kick-ass denim. Lots of cool stuff going on out here. So I just wanted to touch on a couple of neat products that I love. I tried to mention some smaller companies, some friends of mine, you know, 
Amazon and some of the other big box stores have literally made hundreds of billions of dollars since COVID struck. They don't need your money. They're fine. They, they don't they don't need any more of your money. They're okay. But you know who does need your money? These small businesses. That's who needs your money. So make sure you consider clicking on over to any of the websites that I showed you today because they not only have the products that I featured here on the show, of course, but they've got way more kick-ass stuff going on. So go peek in, go cruise through. Some of them are running some sales for the holiday. And most importantly, get your orders in in the next week if you really expect it to be here and be under the tree in time, okay? Now, if you're just shopping for yourself, because I know I know I do that for myself too, you know, do shop at your leisure. <laughs> but these are just some rad companies to keep in mind. All of these companies, I think, are all friends of mine. I think I know all of them in real life. No, there's a handful that weren't, but a lot of them I know in real life. They're real people and they would really love your support right now out here in motorcycle land. So thank you so much for tuning in, everybody. Thank you for the nice notes. Also, I posted uh, on Friday that I had been at the dentist and was having kind of a rough time. And a bunch of you were like giving me the thumbs up and high fives and, and wishing me well. And, and I'm I'm doing a lot better. Uh, I had to have a crown put on if you're wondering what the hell happened. <laughs> and it's a really easy sounding thing like, oh, it's a crown. Man, that's a rough ride. That is not, that's not friendly. <laughs> but it had to happen. I got done. I'll be fine. I'll survive. Um, I'm just a crybaby. But thank you so much for tuning in, everybody. Um, I just, I'm so full of love right now. It's the holiday season. It's a sunny day outside. And I'm just super grateful for each and every one of you for watching the show. And I'm, I'm just feeling my feelings because I got to feature some of my buddies' brands today. So thank you so much for tuning in. Have a great day. I'll be back on Friday um, with, with another show. I'm not quite sure what we're going to talk about. Something I think maybe we'll do a fun fact Friday on Friday. So make sure you hit that notifications on. Make sure you give me a follow and a like over at my page here on the Facebooks because I move all the videos over there as well. So thanks for tuning in, everybody. I We'll see you on Friday. Thanks again to Vroom Retract Vac, VroomYourRoom.com, my show partner for the past year. They are absolutely wonderful, wonderful people. TwoStrokeTees.com, this is my own little shop. Um, I had those shirts made here in Louisville, Kentucky, and I think that they're cool, and maybe you think they are too. I'm offering free shipping here in the U.S. Chopper Town Nation, of course, that's you guys. That's right. Big, big applaud. Big round of applause and high fives to you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. Have a great day and I will see you on Friday.